So earlier, we were talking about the movie OG. Can you tell me what, if there is any, a scene in that movie that resonated to you the most and why? The movie OG on HBO, um, that was produced by uh, uh, Biggs Burke. Yeah. Colin Biggs Burke, who was down with Rockefeller. I watched um, that twice great already. Movie, great movie. Um, Jeffrey Wright was the uh, star in that movie. Um, there was a lot of parts of that movie that resonated um, well with me. Um, the, him going home and getting close to his, his release date. I remember that. I remember that so well because you don't want to really make a big deal of it um, because when people, they know you're going home, they get jealous and they're like, hey, we, let's find a way to keep you here. Right. Yeah. You know, why check should, on 25 yeah, why, to Why should shit. you go home? Yeah. yeah. It's that type of thing. Um, yeah. Aside from that, um, um, you always see somebody who's coming into the system and you're on your way out and you're like this, yo, I hope you don't go through the perils and you deal with things that I dealt with. So let me try to give you some game. Let me school you so yeah. that you don't have, because I'm going to be that. Make and, sure you get your pen and paper. Yeah, and you try to tell them and it's like, they don't get it because the new generation, they, they're not, they're not coming they're to prison. Proud yeah, they're, they're proud of being there. They're proud of being there. You're not proud, proud of being there. You're like this. Yeah. And you, I wasn't proud the day I set foot in um, prison. Mm -hmm. I was, I was never proud. I was mm -hmm. just like, this damn, I'm gonna get out of here. These guys, they come in and they think like, yo, I'm proud, and I maybe I want to make a rap, a, a, a CD when I get out. I want to mm -hmm. rap when I get out, mm -hmm. or whatever. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it's like a badge of honor. Mm -hmm. um, and so you try to tell them things like that, like, you know, listen, you gotta watch yourself. You gotta stay away from this and stay away from that. And you hope and you cross your fingers that they make it out because. You know, when you get out, you start seeing that there's less and less people coming out and more and more people who do come out returning back in. Back you know what I mean? So, you know, um, when I watched that movie, um, it, it hit home a lot. A lot of that movie hit home. You know what I'm saying? Whether it was like small, you know, small situations and anything, whether it was like the whole movie itself. You know? Um, he did a good job with that movie. Oh. Going on, he did a great job. Yo, the you know? symbolism mm -hmm. and the... I felt the anxiety he felt mm -hmm. and through all of the scenarios, meaning like when he first met, um, what do they call him, Bleaker, the, the one with the dreads, anyway, mm -hmm. he when he first met him, I felt his anxiety there. I felt his anxiety when he was going back and forth of what he was going, the decision he was going to make, whether or not he was going to get that gun or not. Oh, okay. Don't tell the movie. Don't tell it. Just kidding! Make, make I'm watch. sorry. <laughs> See, make I talked to it. They can watch it. Yeah, yeah, make them watch it. Yeah, great movie. But anyway, amazing, amazing, amazing film. Great movie. Um, great movie. It gives you a perspective that you don't realize is very important to um, keep in mind when dealing with someone who has been in the system, mm -hmm. especially for that long. Definitely, definitely. Especially for that long. Yeah, it'll definitely get you. It'll definitely get you.